It's very important to make a very good takeoff briefing to be ready in case of anything. We have no engine, we have no second chance. So I'm going to fly a Swift S1, which is a single seat uh, glider for unlimited aerobatic. We need to make sure everything is super, super okay. We will walk around the plane going anti-clockwise to check everything. We start inside of the cockpit, checking that the battery is off, all the switches are off. Then we go through the nose uh, to check that the tubes that goes into the instruments are free. So we can check the airspeed, the altitude, everything. We go along the side and we check the landing gear. We must check that the leading edge of the wing is super smooth, no cracks all the way along. Then we go in the trailing edge here near the tip. We check the aileron and we check what we call the plays. Then we go to the tail and we check the rudder and the vertical empennage, then the horizontal one, just to visually see they have no problems, like cracks, like scratches. It's a pretty simple cockpit. We have the speed indicator in the center. We have the vertical speed indicator on the right, which is a multifunctional display. Then the altimeter. So I can set it at zero, and it goes up to in a uh, hundred uh, meters because we fly very precisely, so every dot is 20 meters, so it's really precise. Then we have the stick, it can move back and front and laterally. And then we have the rudders here, right and left, that moves the, the rear rudder. As you hear, we have the radio, so we can communicate with the ground or with other airplanes on the same frequency. Then I have a stall warning light and sound. You see, now we are on the ground. Of course, the glider is stalled, so it sounds like and he tells me, okay, uh, glider is below the minimum safety speed. Then, speed brake level. It's very powerful. And then, very important things, seat belt. Five points. It's a quick release system. It's mandatory for aerobatic. Then you put this inside the hole and push until it makes this click. I check my emergency shoot. I put a very nice layer of black ship that keeps my back fresh because it's an isolation layer. I need that this handle is in correct position, no problem with the slicing, nothing. Then I go in the back and I check everything is well packed and then we are ready to go. I will make myself a briefing. What are we going to do? In any case, we must think in advance of the glider. So when and if it's going to happen, I will be, let's say, more ready for that.